Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the Black Hell Executor. Now, it's been over a year since the Black Hell Executor has been gone, but it is finally back. It is one of the best free level 7 executors out there without a key system. So you can simply pick it up, download it, and you're ready to go. And it's got one of the best looking UI designs as well. So, I will show you exactly how to download it. I highly recommend watching the full video so you don't miss any steps because I see a lot of comments asking for help and I have already covered those things in the video, okay? So it's really, really important that you watch the complete video. So the very first thing you need to do is of course you need to make sure you're on either Windows 10 or 11. Without being on Windows 10 or 11, this will not work, okay? So it does not work on any other operating system such as Windows 7, Mac, Linux, or anything like that. And of course, it does not work on mobile devices either, okay? And that goes for most of the executors out there. So the very first thing you need to do is go down or over onto this icon if you're on Windows 11. And if you're on Windows 10, the Windows icon should be in the corner right there, okay? So once you have done that, simply go ahead and click on that button and search in virus and threat protection just like that okay go ahead and open that once you have opened it you want to go into manage settings and turn off real-time protection once you do click this it might bring up a little pop-up which asks you to approve it you want to click on yes okay now if your page does not look similar to this and you're on windows 10 and 11 and it says something in orange uh, along the lines of this uh, antivirus is managed by another software then what you need to do is you want to go into this search box again you want to search for control panel go into search or so go into uninstall a program and then look for your antivirus okay so this is completely up to you i cannot help you with this you have a software and antivirus on your computer which of course i will not know about because you th you're the one that downloaded it you need to look for the antivirus find it right click and click on uninstall or you can go into the uh, antivirus settings and disable the antivirus okay so once we have done that now we're ready to go into the download okay so once you go into the download page it will take you to my website that looks similar to this right now you cannot see this video over here because it has not been up uploaded right now okay so by the time you're watching this video the blackout executor should be at the top right here if you don't see it then you simply need to search for blackout and it will come up okay because right now i haven't uploaded the video it does not come up so i'll show you the example with another executor okay so for example if i go over to my website and i want to download the blackout executor you firstly need to find the blackout video click on download and it might open up a pop-up okay so if it opens up a new window right here um and it exits this window then you need to simply close out the new tab and go back onto my website okay and then it might do that twice so you need to make sure you close those new tabs and then you will find the uh, download to um okay so you can see it opened up a a pop-up i need to close that then you'll find the download to minra and of course blackout okay so this is just an example video um but for the blackout video it will look similar to this so firstly you need to download minra okay so again it opened up a an ad so let's close out that let's click the link again it opened up another ad okay never mind it didn't open up another ad okay so once it takes you to link vertiz that means it, it's worked properly okay now again you just want to follow the steps just go ahead and click that click on free access and it will take you to the vinra website over here you want to click on this and just choose desktop and just set up the application okay i've already got vinra installed as you can see right here so i don't need to do that again next you want to go into the the description and find the link for the blackout executor okay so it will be the same thing you want to click on the download link again and once it takes you to the link with as website then you're ready to go okay so it will take you to this website right here you want to go ahead and check this box and then go ahead and click on free access uh, once you do click on free access it will take you to a new window okay so you want to copy this link and open this link again once you do that you need to prove it again click on free access and then it will take you to the final checkpoint okay so you once you want to do the exact same thing again um here we go click on free access and it will give you the option to download the blackout executor okay so before you do that you need to in install in this case it's given me an offer right here so i need to go ahead and click on that i need to install and launch the avg browser so let's go ahead and click on that let's go ahead and choose desktop let me go ahead and set this up here we go so it's currently loading it's starting that up um 
I'm just going to go ahead and change that so it doesn't set it up as a default browser. And here we go. So it's currently setting up the browser for me. So I'm completing that step. And as soon as that has been done, we'll be ready to go. All right, you can already see it says task completed. Uh, and that's just installing the browser, but it has been set up right here. So we can go ahead and close out of that now. And AVG has now uh, opened as well. So we can once again close out that and click on continue to black or executor. Now it's not guaranteed that you will get that little offer right there, but sometimes you can. And now we're ready to click on download black or executor. I'm going to go ahead and choose on desktop. There we go. And it has now downloaded. So we can go ahead and open this from here or we can go to our desktop and open it. So for me, I'm just going to go ahead and open it from here. It's going to start up the installation. I'm going to click on next. I'm going to click on skip all and there we go so we can now go ahead and click on open it will take us to the download page we can click on download select our desktop and if it gives you a little error right here you want to go ahead and click on Control and j and then you want to go ahead and approve the download it will say keep file you want to click on that and then you will be ready to go okay now i can go over to my desktop i can delete all of these we no longer need them and the icon should look similar to this okay because we've downloaded winrar and it has to match the WinRAR icon. If it does not look like this, then you need to right click it, go ahead and click on open with and choose WinRAR right there, okay? Once you have done that, then you can right click it, go onto WinRAR and make sure you click on open with WinRAR, okay? Don't click anything else. Just go ahead and click on open with WinRAR and then click on extract to choose your location. In my case, I'm going to choose desktop. I'm gonna click okay. And it will ask me for a password now the password is blackout there are no spaces and the b is uppercase i will also leave the password in the description okay then we'll go go ahead and click on okay and there we go okay so now we can delete this folder because we've got the blackout folder right here okay and then we can open it and you can see all of the files that are needed right there okay so before you do anything let's go ahead and go down here again go into virus and threat protection and then go into manage settings scroll all the way down click on add or remove exclusions click on add an exclusion click on folder click on desktop and then go ahead and choose that blackout folder make sure you don't double click it because that will open up the folder okay so make sure you just click it one time and it highlights that folder then go ahead and click on select folder and once you have done that you can back out of that and then you can turn on real-time protection and the folder will not get deleted okay so now you're ready to use this folder you've got your antivirus back on and you're ready to launch the executor in the game okay now if you want to delete a program such as this for example that you had to download then you can go into the control panel go into uninstall a program search for the program you had to download so for me it's just avg secure browser i click on un uninstall and that will start the um on installation and then i will also go ahead and click on delete browser history uninstall and there we go the browser has now been removed and once this has finished we can click on ok sure and then we can just close out of that tab right there and we're done so if i go back and check in my control panel it will no longer be there as you can see so that's pretty much how you set up blackout now we'll jump into a game and i will show you the uh, blackout executor in action all right here we go so we're jumping into arsenal now i'll go back over to my desktop i'll go ahead and open blackout and i will launch this application make sure you download and launch the blackout application and you don't actually launch this by accident okay so let's go ahead and launch that now and there we go so once you have launched it then you want to click on inject you can open up the blackout executor before you open the game it does not matter once you click on inject just give it a couple of seconds you can see it opens up this page it's injecting and then if this page doesn't close you can just minimize out of that that's not a problem at all and then of course this will take you to my youtube page where you can subscribe to the channel to stay updated with all the latest content and of course if you're not already subscribed make sure to subscribe to the channel drop a like as well for more future latest script and executor showcases okay and of course you can also join our discord server by clicking over here now we've already injected so all you have to do now is of course paste your script okay so you can find scripts over here as well um what you can also do is if you go into the blackout folder you can go into the scripts folder and you can paste your own script in here 
Um, so next time if you want to use a script you can just find it in here you simply double click it and it will load into your executor okay but i'm gonna go ahead and put the owl hub script back into the executor you can also click on open file which will go ahead and uh, allow you to browse through your computer to search for a script that you've downloaded or you can save the current file to a destination now we've already injected so we can simply go ahead and click on execute and that will go ahead and execute the script so we can minimize out of the blackout executor or we can close it it does not matter i'm just going to go ahead and minimize and here we go so we've got the owl hub script now injected you can turn on whatever you like right now i'm just using the most blatant settings <laughs> i would not recommend these um, but let's go ahead and showcase a bit of the executor for you so we've injected the owl hub script and you can see it is working completely fine uh, this the objects that you sort of have to throw they don't really work with silent aim um, that's not the fault of the script it's just how um, silent aim works okay so this isn't something you can just sort of lock onto enemies I can still aim lock on like that um, there we go we've got them and now you can see silent aim is back in action or silent aim bot here we go perfect let's find a few more enemies okay that one's up there there's one coming around the corner and he just died oh there's another cheater in hand no wonder why okay so yeah th there's another cheater who's just using speed hacks as well um but yeah hopefully he is using blackout uh if he's not he should definitely switch over to, <laughs> to blackout okay, so this is pretty much the executor guys hopefully you did enjoy the video if you did make sure to drop a like as i said subscribe to the channel and as always thanks for watching